Good morning. <laughs> Surprise, it's April. I'm doing another unboxing. Um, you know, this is for me, uh, you know, I don't usually videotape myself to uh, speak to anybody. I, I call work in the morning, but they don't see my face. Um, or my, you know, they do hear my voice. It's always a little bit deeper, a little bit groggier in the morning. I have had a sip or two of coffee, but um, I'm not one that chugs my first cup of coffee. As a matter of fact, I've still got it in the kitchen um, in there. And um, I just really like to sip on it first thing in the morning. I, I, the taste, you know, right now I have, um, or we have, you know, I call this machine in my kitchen um, mine. And Mark has, you know, three or, you know, two machines now in the garage. And we, you know, of course he has his machine at work and we have plenty on our storage shelf at in the garage just in case, but, and, you know, the traveling machine. Um, but this one in here, I call it mine because I get to choose the coffee that goes in, uh, depending upon what either I've bought just to keep in stock for, um, you know, when we have lots of guests or um, when the club comes over or even, um, you know, when I leave on a vacation or when we leave on a vacation and Tina's here. But uh, every now and then, you know, we have different ones we both tend to like. So um, right now uh, we came back from Maui um, with uh, some coffee from a place called Village Coffee in Lahaina. Actually, it's in Whalers Village in, in uh, Kanapali. You know, and it's funny, we used it in Mark's machine first and we tried it and we thought, oh, we don't really like this too much. And then we put it in my machine. I thought, well, we got to drink it, right? Um, so we put it in my machine and wow, I don't know. They're the same machines. It's so weird. Um, they're the same machines. We have Vienna, you know, um, you know, you put the bean in, automatically grinds it and um, it's the same machine. So I'm not exactly, same water. We, <laughs> we use the same water. Anyways, it tastes really great in my machine and it's almost done. And we had one more. Um, we had bought a huge, uh, I think it was like a two and a half pound bag of the first one we tried, which was their number one, which was truthfully t really, really good. And um, now I just put in the uh, second one, which is their private reserve estate blend. And I haven't, you know, you don't want to let the, um, you know, the grinder get dry, right? So right when you know you've got the last of one bean in there and you know, after a while you could tell when it's getting close, you want to add that other bean. Um, so that way it doesn't go make a horrible noise. And um, next thing you know, you're, you're, you're spinning your wheels without any beans to grind. So anyways, that's what's in there right now. And it is yummy. So I savor the taste and I think it's my last, my last one, um, my last cup of coffee of, of the uh, number one. So we'll see how the private reserve tastes. And if it's really good, we will um, have that. I'll order that again and have it shipped here from from Maui to inner, you know, group in with Invader, right? Because I love Invader coffee and, um, you know, I just like to have a different taste once in a while. So what, uh, three minutes of April's coffee moment, you know, Mark laughed. I heard him listening to my video in here while I was cooking, um, making us, you know, I make homemade pizzas on Friday night and, um, dang, you know, he was laughing cause he, I, you know, I tell you guys, um, I'm not going to make this a long video and then it ends up being a long video because I talk about random shit, right? Um, and, you know, I decided last night, I said, F it, you know, normally I would say the word because just that's who I am. But um, F it, man, I, I'm not going to, I'm not going to worry. I'm just going to do me, going to do me, um, whatever I feel like talking about with you all, um, you know, it's, it's, it's a way to, as I've said before, you get to know me. And it's really, truthfully, a great way for me to understand how to do um, these kind of um, uploads, these videos for the future of, of two, you know, two other channels. You know, I want to do one for work, but I really do need to make sure that I'm, I'm kind of practiced at what I'm saying um, on that particular channel. And then I have another idea for one. And um, no, it doesn't have anything to do with pinball. I mean, pinball, with uh, penny slots. So, you know, we have, I have a lot of packages here, boys, right? And girls, because I have men and women on my channel. Um, so, you know, I'm opening um, one this morning. Actually, I'm opening two this morning. And that will leave me with only three left. <laughs> Yes. I, I don't know if I'm kidding anymore today. You know, it's funny. I told Mark, I would have had probably like 12 here. I, I had um, some big boxes that I sent to work of things I don't need right now. 
but I will need in the future. Um, so I just put them at work and stored them there. It's just so, so much easier. Anyways, this is from um, a thing called bulb head and it's to me and truthfully I have no idea what it is I mean I had a I had a feeling um that it might be you know I ordered some things we need from Amazon I think I told you guys last night in the video that you know I ordered a lot of random little things here and uh anybody who stays up you know past 11 and watches some random random ass you know cable channel will see a lot of infomercials you know like my skinny stacks that you saw Mark you know buy me well, one of the things that you will see is a thing called Hempvana. And uh, not that I'm, um, I'm promoting, uh, you know, smoking some weed, because that is not us. You know damn well, you know, Mark and I are clean, sober, and have been for over 20 years. But um, some of the products made out of the hemp seed are, are very good. And I don't want to ever take anything internally. So if it's something I have to put in my mouth, I'm not going to do. But but this thing here, you see a commercial it's called Hempvana. Um, you know, it's a muscle pain relief. It's kind of like icy hot. And, you know, truthfully, we use something called Sombra. And the whole family has used something called Sombra. S-O-M-B. Sombra? S-O-M-B-R-A, I think. Um, for many years. And they it comes in a warming therapy and a cold therapy. And the warming therapy for Sombra is the best one to get. It's the best relief of any sort of um, muscle spasms, muscle aches that I have ever had in my life. And, you know, originally it was recommended to my sister um, from a back doctor, which she was seeing. And um, and we all got, you know, she tried it, she told us about it. And then, I mean, the family ordered it by cases. We just keep a case around them, you know, it's in a jar. And then they, Somber finally came out with something that was like this, a stick that you can roll on, right? What I find about Sombra is that it's very, it's strong scented. Um, it's, it's a, it is really good. Um, you just can't beat it. And the, and the, the cream that you put on, if you are hurting someplace, especially like in your back or your knees or your shoulders, and you go to put that on pretty good, but I mean, you will smell because it's a strong scent. Um, meaning, um, like a methylated, you know, type of scent, but it, but it's really strong. Um, and you might have to clean your sheets after you sleep, but you will wake up feeling better. I mean, I've woke up, done that, you know, playing tennis. I've hurt myself. I feel a little spasms and I put that on and, um, you know, I just put it, you know, this is like, this is my sleepy shirt. Yeah, that's one of my sleepy shirts where I put, um, you know, I put one of these sleepy shirts on and, um, and it looks way it covers it. So it stays, you know, tight against my skin. And, uh, man, I wake up feeling at least more, usually more than 50% better. It's crazy. I, I didn't believe it the first time it happened. I thought, what? Now this doesn't where I, I, the cream doesn't quite work like that. Um, there is a jar of cream that we have here, but what I liked about this for pain relief um, is that it works for mild cases. So like, you know, if, if I've got a twinge in my back that's not like something that, you know, is causing me to really feel a lot of pain, I might put some on. And, you know, I, I put this, actually, truthfully, I put this on almost every morning in a spot. Um, last, well, we were in, in uh, the pandemic and we were shut down. Mark and I took a motorcycle ride and we um, hit a, a bump, um, like a divot in the road. And it's one. It's the first time in 30, 30 some odd years that I've hit a divot and not been prepared like for that or sitting just, just in a wrong, the wrong way to take that divot. And it was a big one and it jarred my back. And ever since it's just been really, that spot has been really tender. It doesn't, um, I haven't really gone any place to look at it because truthfully, I don't really, I, I just muscle through the pain normally. Um, I thought it would go away. I think eventually I will, but I'm not willing to take that time to do anything about it now. And Sombra works, of course, but it's not that bad. You know, it's just like this little, uh, so when I play tennis, usually I, I'll definitely use it before I go play tennis in that spot. And I have some knees that kind of have um, some issues. So uh, this little cream, Hempvana, is actually good for mild things. It's, it's better than Icy Hot, not as good as Sombra. So that's what one of the things I got for you today. And um, the next one is a box from, oh, you know, I, I sh I'll just show you a box from Amazon. Everybody knows that, you know, when you see those kind of symbols, it's Amazon. You know, I forgot, you know, it was early, right? You know, everyone, I forgot to, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, to, forgot to put my name, you know, put the marker on my name. You know, that's all right. It happens. Um, you know, I, tr I don't even know if it was on the first one, but. I try and remember, um, Mark's so good about it. And I'm usually really good about it too. I usually mark it when I, when I bring it in, at least if it's, if it's for me, because I don't want to forget if when I'm doing a video, 
you know, I ordered, um, like I told you guys, there's a box in a box, a box in a box. Um, I ordered a lot of little things from Amazon. They're more personal items. I know what these are, you know, I know um, that I needed them and I just, you know, these are the kind of things that would just been sitting on a file cabinet work. And I just thought, man, I could just put them up here and put them away. I don't have to worry about, um, you know, transporting them. Yesterday, you know, it's all about, you know, the little things that I wear as far as um, perfume goes. And I'm gonna put my little boxy knife away. And today is about some of the lotions that I use. Um, I believe I actually might have another one coming of a different, um, flavor. You like that? I tell you, yesterday I was cracking myself up at myself. Oh, my flavor, what's up? But, you know, it is what it is. The scents sometimes just, I don't know why they come out as flavors, because they smell so good, they almost smell like flavors. But um, the, I'm, you know, speaking of uh, the hemp seed, um, you know, hemp's body lotion, you can't beat it, girls. You cannot beat it. If you do not use this, you probably really should try. Um, it is it is absolutely one of the best lotions on the market. You know, my mother always brought us up as girls up to use um, things to take care of our skin. Even though we're in the sun, um, you know, always take care of our skin. And one of the things she was really hip on was anything that would help our face stay moisturized and our skin stay moisturized. And through the years, of course, products come and gone, right? Um, but I'm one that uses a lot of good facial product um, all the time. Um, I you know, test little things and our mom does or my sister does and, and then we pass each other the information. And right now I'm I'm big on rodent and fields uh, for some of the um, extra areas like in here and up here. Um, and then Nerium is a special um, a special lotion. You know, I'm a dis actually I have a I'm a distributor of Miriam, but I don't sell it. You know, it's like I just use it for myself because I got a better price. Anyways, um, if anybody of you want Nerium, I can get it for you at a discounted price. It's still very expensive, but it lasts a long time. Um, usually, one pump bottle lasts me at, at least I mean, at least a month, um, and it's 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 good for lines. You know, um, now this this one is just for the body and the um, one of the scents that I love is koa and sweet almond and honest to goodness oh it's right it's probably oh no it's not if you were to oh man it this one you know because i wear the joe malone perfume and uh or cologne whichever you want to call it um the, the it that's a strong enough scent it's a it's a it's what i want to smell like and i don't want to have something on my body that's interfering with that scent um, but this scent is just, it's kind of got a sweet smell to it, very light, sweet smell, and it complements a floral scent. That's what I found. So if I'm wearing anything with flowers, um, this complements a floral scent. So yeah, hemp lotion is the other thing I have for you today. You know, sometimes I feel like, you know, I'm giving you a lot of information behind products that, um, that you may or may not even care about, but, um, you know, I'm an, you know, Mark's investigative reporter on a lot of things that have to do with more guy stuff, right? But sometimes he's an impulse. <laughs> I love you, baby. But sometimes he'll be an impulsive guy, right? He'll just, you know, like you won't know until you buy it kind of thing, right? I'm a research, you know, when it comes to this kind of stuff, you know, I'm not taking, um, you know, I'm not, I'm going to, I'm going to buy it after I know I like it, I'll buy a small one first, try it out, and then I'll buy the big one. So yeah, and and when because I do do that, I really want to be able to share that information with you. You know, you um, if you're a girl watching my channel and you see um, some girl products, you may think to yourself, man, maybe I need to try that because April really likes it, and there may these guys come in a ton of scents. So if you like last night, if you're a citrus girl, or you're a musky type of person, or a lot anything you can find something. They even have a plain one, it's called original, it just has no scent at all, that will match your body and the chemistry of your, of your body's um, skin. And that's really important. Um, if you um, have little aches and pains, you know, you know now that I've tried it, this is for mild and the other ones, you know, maybe I'll do, next time I do an unboxing, I'll just bring out the Sombra so you guys can see with the name and what it looks like. Um, cause it's, it's a big deal. And for, for guys, um, you know, who are working all the time, you know, marks on his feet all day long, sometimes crawling through tunnels, you know, um, 
it's important to have things like this on hand for those aches and pains, especially as we get older. Um, not saying anything, because when you're young, you get them too. Um, so yeah, that's what I've got for you this morning. Um, you know, it's beautiful outside here in Northern California. Um, the morning feels crisp and clean. Um, you know, we've certainly had, you know, days of it feel, you know, especially like a month ago where it was just air was the quality was terrible because of all the fires here. Um, but today is crisp and clean. It's a day where I wish I was playing tennis kind of because it's really nice outside, but we've got other things we have to do and we're going to go do them. So um, whatever you're doing today, whether you're going to relax and just watch a bunch of YouTube videos or you're going to go and do errands for your household or um, you're going to go and visit family and friends, whatever it is, man, make, make it a great day. Enjoy it. And look at this time, uh, my braids on the other side, so I'll do the do the heart here and do the heart here. Anyways, guys, peace out. Have a great day unless you've made other plans.